On the Broadwater Farm estate where Mark Dorgan lived, many people I spoke to were furious at a verdict which ruled that his death was lawful. Walking through the estate, I met boxer Daniel Suarez. He said people had a right to be angry, but hoped that a vigil due to be held this weekend would be peaceful. Feeling on board of a farm right now, personally, is very bad. Very, very bad. People have got it. Quite a few tears have been shedded. Personally, how I feel about the verdict it's not lawful killing. So do you think this has further damaged the relationship between people in this community and the police? Yeah, 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 proper, 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 proper. People can't trust the police on it. So on Saturday, outside the police station, there's going to be a vigil mm -hmm. for, for Mark. Mm -hmm. what, what are your feelings about that? Will you go? Personally, I don't feel anxious, I don't feel nervous. I'm just taking it all in my stride, but hopefully the vigil does end peacefully. It's for Mark, not for them, and it's for the family as well, and for the kids as well. Would people think twice about the riots? No, they only think twice. It's happened once, if they can do it once, they can do it again. I don't agree with the looting and all of that. They did not do any damage at all. So basically we're fighting against ourselves, rather against the person, the people that, who are responsible for it. That's who we take it to. And the people that we're taking it to is the police. That's who we've got to take it to. We've got to take it, the battle to them. Not physically, no, not by violence, but it's just by the tears, the anger, the emotion, the injustice of what's just happened.